Hi, I'm Sandata here at Villarreal. Welcome to Video Assisted Instruction C Language Programming Series. Last topic, we have the escape sequence. Okay, we discussed this. And it is scattered on the screen by using uh, the escape sequence backslash t and backslash n. Right now, our topic for today is about the C data types. Okay, so let's define first what is a C data type. Okay, it is an extensive system used for. Declaring variables or function of different types. Okay, it is an extensive system used for declaring variables or function of different types. Okay. Now, uh, it answers also the question of how much space it occupies in storage and it also answered the question of how the bit pattern is stored okay is interpreted Okay, that is the meaning of the uh, C data types. Now let's proceed with the uh, four classification of uh, C data types. Okay, so number one, we have the uh, basic types, okay, which is an integer and a uh, float floating point okay number two we have the uh, enumerated type which is the same but it is considered to be a constant Number three, we have the void type. Okay, so this one is an specifier. Okay, and it has to, and it has no value. And the last one, we have the derive types okay which is a pointer array structure union and and a function okay that is the uh, C data types we have and right now I'm going to discuss about the basic types of C which is integer okay let's do the code So, uh, the first thing you're going to identify is to type the word int, stands for integer. Next, we have a space or a white space. Then, you can create your uh, variable name, like uh, number. Okay? Then, uh, semicolon. Afterwards, Okay, you can uh, type also integer. It could be considered as 
for example we have uh, cash okay cash for an integer so let's have an example okay another we have integer like uh, we have the sale okay so those are an example of integer okay so what we need uh, right now is to click this uh, so data program 8 and we exclude that from the our project so that we can click debug and start without debugging so to make it clear that this code is considerably running initializing every year ready and uh, will succeed it that's it there should be no output because we declare only the data type that the number is an integer a cash variable is an integer and a sale is an integer okay so uh, thank you for your time watching this video if you want more videos check out my email syvillarealjr0105 1975 at yahoo.com.ph good luck